Another class of agents that warrants attention are the BCR able inhibitors used for CML and recently or in the past few years have also led to additional indications. These agents include imatinib, dasatinib, nilotinib, and ponatinib. These agents are noteworthy for several reasons. Although they are well tolerated, about 60% of patients on imatinib develop a maculopapular rash often associated with pruritus and very dry skin. On the other hand, with the other agents such as dasatinib, nilotinib, and ponatinib, the rash occurs in only about a third of patients. What is interesting about this rash is that in about a third of patients receiving these BCR able inhibitors, the skin assumes these nutmeg greater or very rough and dry appearance. The treatment for this rough skin, otherwise known in the dermatologic literature as keratosis pilaris, is with the use of topical moisturizers that contain exfoliants, such as ammonium lactate or lactic acid, salicylic acid, or urea. Patients will complain of this very rough and dry skin, and the use of these topical exfoliants should be used in these patients with caution as in any open or erythematous areas, they can cause burning. I suggest that these patients perhaps should uh, be referred to a dermatologist if one is available.